翻开中华民族五千年的文明史，有一条横贯欧亚大陆的贸易交通线，古称丝绸之路。今天。与新欧国际铁路联运大通道尽运而生，再次让古老丝路焕发光芒。与新欧这条国际物流大通道的起始站——重庆，已成为中国众多省市与东南亚、中亚和欧洲之间物流贸易的重要枢纽。今天的重庆，正在巨门扩张，形成越来越强的磁场。产生着不可抗拒的引领力，一个以重庆为原点、创新为动力、整合全球资源的宏大蓝图正在徐徐展开。在沿线各国海关和铁路的大力支持下，重庆在原亚欧大陆桥的基础上，进一步优化线路和完善功能，创新开通了与新欧国际铁路联运大通道。二零一二年四月十二日，渝新欧重庆物流有限公司挂牌成立，这为渝新欧国际物流大通道建设注入了新动力，标志着重庆打造国际物流枢纽迈出重要一步。Okay, thank you, uh, Mr. Zhou. Hello, everyone. Can you hear me clearly? Okay, everyone. I, I. Okay, let's start our course tonight. Yes, thank you, Mr. Zhou, and welcome everybody. I know some uh, students from the different countries. Some come from Pakistan, Middle Asian, and some uh, uh, Africa and the other country. Okay, welcome, welcome to the course of our the international uh, logistic and the business of the COPT. And my topic is China, Singapore, Chongqing, demonstrative, intuitive, and strategic collective. We call it short as CCI. And uh, the next course is about the e-commerce, uh, the cross-border e-commerce between China and Europe, especially about the FBA. FBA means filled by Amazon. So this is uh, the uh, developed very uh, fast in the in the past ten years. Uh, nowadays, more choice in China. We uh, use the, the Alibaba, the Jindong, and the Pinduoduo, a, a lot of the e-commerce um, platforms. Uh, uh, in Europe or in other country, we use, the, the, uh, for example, in Singapore, we use the, the Shopee. Uh, in Europe, we use the, the Amazon. And also other, uh, just like TikTok, 
and uh, Azada and uh, a lot of the uh, cross border e-commerce. So we uh, we we'll talk about the uh, cross e-commerce uh, logistic between the uh, China to the other country. So this is an example shared as China to Europe. And uh, okay, I checked how many students online, and we will start soon. Moment, I check. Oh, okay. Okay, there are about the twenty students on the on the line. Okay, let's start. Uh, I do a brief introduce about myself. Hello everyone, I'm Roy Huang and uh, nowadays uh, I worked uh, uh, in two different, com different companies but uh, both of them are part a joint venture of Yixin O company. One is the uh, Sinek Evo so Nook Evo is uh, I'm the uh, vice GM of these companies. More about the, the some of the ports, some of the environment uh, to do some of the uh, developed. And the second is the YPL. YPL is a joint venture uh, uh, Yixin O company and uh, Singapore logistic company uh, behind the CCI project. Uh, I'm in charge of the the sales and the marketing also, uh, and uh, in the last in the past five years, I worked on the e-commerce logistic in Europe. So this is uh, shared as about the two topics uh, in this course. Tonight we will talk more about the Chongqing and the CCI project and share some of the uh, interesting projects of the CCI. Yeah, we will talk about the five, um, the five uh, questions. What is a CCI, this project, and why CCI choose Chongqing in China? I don't know, maybe uh, some students have visited Chongqing before, uh, I think before uh, the coronavirus coron coron virus between the 2020, maybe you visited in China or in Chongqing. Uh, Chongqing is a very interesting uh, city and uh, also the biggest city in China. Uh, I, I, I maybe also a big city, very big city in the world. And the third is about what CCI can do for us. So for us, for normally logistic company, or maybe for the normal um, uh, schools, or maybe some universities, some the finance company, and some the uh, another parts we can what we can do in the CCI. And uh, the fourth is uh, parts of the CSI project results. Uh, and uh, the last part is a way discussion about the topic is. Uh, this is uh, the, the CCI. CCI is short of China, Singapore, Chongqing demonstration initiative on critical connectivity. This is a uh, uh, very, very great and uh, important project between uh, government to government, China uh, with Singapore. Um, so, you know, uh, in the past 30 years, China is uh, the, the, the very, very important country that developed the fast, very, very fast. I think that this is one of the uh, fastest, uh, the most fast uh, economic of the, the part of the world. And uh, also, uh, Singapore is a very uh, developed country in the ASEAN, and also um, most of the people of the Singapore are Chinese. 
I think maybe seventy uh, percent. So uh, we uh, push some of the uh, government uh, projects uh, on the different area. Can see, yeah, the this project of the CCI uh, pushed the doors about the partnership uh, on the. Uh, 2015, and uh, Chongqing as the operation or center of CCI. Actually, as before, uh, Singapore and China uh, sent the first the first project center in Suzhou. So Suzhou uh, uh, Industry Park. A lot of Singapore companies and also some of the, the Southeast Asia companies uh, invested in Suzhou. Uh, and uh, the second is in Tianjin. In Tianjin and uh, more focused on the environment. So uh, some of the, the water companies, some of the, 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 the environment control and some of the how to make our air fresh and some make our water clean, just like that. And the, the, the third one I looked in Chongqing and Chongqing in the, is a city of the uh, south, southwest of China. So the, this project will uh, the development targets on the financial uh, service. This is the first one. And the China uh, more rules and uh, some the different, uh, uh, different laws on the financial, especially international financial. And then the second is uh, aviation. A vision uh, between the, the airports and also the flying uh, roads, uh, especially the, 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 the Singapore is the, the air hub and also the ship hub, logistic hub of the Southeast China, Southeast of Asia, and uh, very important transit from the Africa to, to the uh, East Asia or Africa or Europe or other area to the uh, this part, this uh, um, Southeast Asia as a, um, uh, um, East Asia, just like that. And the third one is uh, transport and the logistics. Uh, you know, this is very important, uh, especially in the past three years. Uh, we focused on the, uh, the supply chain management and also some the especially um, medical cargo or some the industry cargo or e-commerce cargo uh, of the supply to the different uh, supermarket, different uh, uh, the buyers or companies. And the last one is about the information and the communication technology. This is very, nowadays, very important. We talk about some the AI, some the, the, the smart city, smart company, smart technology for the service. And uh, we use the 5G and uh, some the um, more smart, about some of the device and all the uh, management of the company to make some of the new, new choice, new uh, service uh, for the uh, information area. So this is a, a new one. As before, uh, Singapore is, uh, did very well on the information and the communication technology. And uh, so, and also China, uh, there is uh, the biggest uh, uh, market for most uh, uh, most uh, companies, almost the com countries. So this is a uh, very, very also very important area. I check it, moment. Check everyone. Hear me? It's it's okay. Okay, let's continue.
this is why CCI choose Chongqing in China. Chongqing, this is we will share some about interest uh, introduce about the the city of Chongqing and the different different ways uh, baking. Shanghai, not like Guangzhou, not like Shenzhen. And also the Singapore, yeah, you, you can see the maps. So this is very important in Asia, connected to the Southeast Asia and also the East Asia. So this is why CCI, this project, choose Chongqing in China. And you can see the map. The, the red one, the red area is uh, Chongqing, the city of Chongqing. Uh, yes, that's true, this is the city, but this city is very, very, very big, uh, like a, a small province in China, just like that. And uh, Okay, Chongqing is the only, uh, the only municipality developed under the central government from Beijing in the middle uh, uh, western area of China. There are four uh, cities in China um, governed directly by uh, Beijing. Just one is Beijing. Shanghai, uh, Chongqing, and Tianjin. So there are only four. And the second is um, Chongqing, also the uh, economic center of the upper layer of Yangtze River. Um, I, I will introduce about the China. Uh, a lot of developed area around the Yangtze River. The Yangtze River uh, in the, in the uh, on the one side is Shanghai and on the other side is Chongqing. So Chongqing is a very big economic part of the upper area of Yangtze River. And also uh, Chongqing is a very, very important base of the mechanic uh, manufacturing industry of China, just like um, vehicles, just like motorbikes, some of the in uh, industry equipment, uh, just like laptops. Nowadays, you know, uh, about uh, maybe you use uh, laptops to now, maybe HP, maybe Dell, maybe uh, Asus, Acker, and other brands of the laptops. And uh, nowadays, Chongqing um, uh, produced about new Chongqing. Uh, 60 million, 60 million laptops per year. So it's about 40% of the share of global. So maybe you buy the laptops in Europe, maybe in your country, in maybe in Myanmar, in Pakistan, in, in, in other country, uh, these laptops made in Chongqing. And the way use the international logistic send the laptops from the factory in Chongqing to other country. And the, the fourth is a transport hub of the southwest China. And you can see Chongqing have the railway to connect to the very, very important area. One is around the Yangtze River. Yeah, yes. Chongqing is an area, and the Chongqing have the, the railway connected to the, the, the Shanghai. Shanghai is the, the, develop, the most developed city of China, and also this area is the strong economic uh, area of China. And uh, another railway connected to Hong Kong, to Shenzhen, Guangzhou, this area. This also is a very uh, strong economic area. And uh, another railway, just like this, to connect to the, the Los, 
the law uh, the loss uh, west area and uh, to Kazakhstan and uh, Russia and uh, Belarus and Poland and the uh, Europe and nowadays we also some the new uh, railway just like this from to Xinjiang is provincing and connected to the cars and connected to the Kyrgyzstan and the Uzbekistan and also in future also cars to Pakistan and also Chongqing also opened the new railway connected to, to from Chongqing to Vietnam and Chongqing Yunnan to Laos to the Vientiane. Yes, I visited Laos many times and also uh, uh, stayed in, in, in Vientiane and between the Lankai of Thailand and connected to this area. And also some of the Yunnan and to connect to Myanmar and to the Myanmar to some of the port to the Indian uh, Ocean. So this is uh, just like a uh, transport hub. And this is a railway. This is only railway. And the way also uh, 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 Yangtze River. Yangtze River we are linked to Sichuan, Chongqing, Hubei, and uh, Jiangxi, Anhui, and uh, Jiangsu, and uh, finally Shanghai. And in the Yangshan River, uh, Yangshan port, and connected to the, uh, the ocean ships to the anywhere of the world. This is a very uh, interesting, and uh, we uh, build a new some of the logistic uh, solution. For example, from the Chongqing railway to connect the Guangxi, and then take the ocean ships to the anywhere. This is just like a multimodal logistic, multimodal railway and uh, ocean ship. So this is uh, this is uh, that's why we call the transport hub of the southwest China. And also we opened uh, we opened the 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 commercial environment to the different uh, companies, different uh, country, and uh, uh, more than fifty percent of the top fifty hundred companies sent the branch company or maybe office in Chongqing. Uh, yes, and also they connected to the one row one bed and the Yangtze River economic bed. So this is uh, about the information about Chongqing. Okay, here is the, the, the Chongqing, very beautiful city, right? Chongqing around, around the Yangtze River and a lot of mountains uh, around the city. So we, we call the Chongqing mountain city and also a lot of our bridge so we also call the bridge cities. Uh, Chongqing, yes, the center of the economic, financy, uh, science and technology, uh, innovation, international and domestic logistic trade, and so on in the upper area of Yangtze River. And also very uh, great and important city in the west of China. Its population of Chongqing is 32.12 million. And the, the, yes, the, the, the very uh, huge population, right? This is the city is just like a middle country. <laughs> Last year, I, I, I stayed in Europe about uh, six months. And uh, we lived in we, we lived in the in the Budapest. The population of Hungary is uh, about uh, ten million. So just uh, I make a joke of friends of the Budapest. Yes, yeah, so we the population of our hometown is three times of the Buda, of the Hungary. Yes, and the GDP of the China of the the Hong Chongqing only Chongqing is about four. Hundred million billion billion uh, U.S. dollars in 2021. So this is very interesting. So it's very strong on the economic uh, and also industry of the uh, area. 
and uh, uh, just like that, some of the photos about the Chongqing. And this is, uh, you can see that here is the Chongqing. This is the Yangtze River, this is a lot of river. Yes, and uh, you know, uh, in the in the part uh, around the rivers and a lot of mountains just like that. And this is something different. So, and uh, a lot of a lot of uh, uh, yeah yeah, some they introduce about the airport, about airport Chongqing uh, Jiangbei International Airport also the the top five airports in China. The first is uh, uh, Putong Airport, Peking Airport, uh, Guangzhou Airport, Chengdu Airport, just like uh, Chongqing Airport. Sometimes uh, um, the Daxin Airport, yes. But most uh, Chongqing is a very uh, big in airports in China. And also the port, the river port around the Yangtze River. This is port is also the biggest river, uh, uh, real river intermodal port of the Yangtze River. And uh, I have some of the photos about this port. And uh, yes, our the headquarters, the Yuxing O, is, is the first send the China railway from China to Europe, to, to, to the Duisburg of, of the Germany, of Europe connected to China and to Europe by rail. And also, nowadays, we send the block train from China to, to Hanoi, or to uh, Vientiane, and uh, uh, Vietnam, and the Vientiane of Laos, and also more cities inter around the country in future. Uh, and Chongqing is also one of the most popular tourist domestic in China. In this is uh, the only only one week in the National Day, in National Day, National Day holidays in 2019. It's about received 386 point, just like 387 million domestic and overseas visitors in, China, in Chongqing. So this is a lot of, but in the past two years, the, 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 the coronavirus, the virus, uh, everything is shut down. But in future, I think we will be grow, grow up very fast. Okay, just now I shared some of the, about the information some, and the photos about the Chongqing. Uh, very interesting and also welcome to visit Chongqing. Okay, the next thing is about what this I can do for us. So just like I shared, there are very, very important four cooperation contents and developed targets in CCI, the financial service, the avi uh, aviation, transport and the logistics, and also information and the communicate technology. This is the four parts. In the past 10, 10, uh, seven years, about 453 projects and agreement are signed. And also the one of them is the YPL, this company. So this is pushed some the China part, to Singapore part, and the, the joint venture and the work together, just like that. Uh, this is, uh, this is the, the, the logistic the, about that. This is uh, about the logistic of the CCI project. It means uh, the Chongqing connect to Singapore. This is an area about the, the, the avi, 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 aviation of four hours can cover a lot of the country. And this is a railway of Yuxing O and also the China Europe railway, block trains connected to Duisburg of Germany. Yes, a lot nowadays uh, not only Duisburg uh, but also some of the Hamburg, uh, Budapest, uh, Manashevich of Poland uh, and other cities just like the the the, the Lords of Poland and the 
the chief work of the Netherlands and some of the other cities, Milano of Italy, and also the, the Vienna of Austria, and, uh, and, uh, and the Brack of the, the, the Czech, is a lot of. And uh, I, in the last, uh, in the past 10 years, I also visit a lot of cities of Europe uh, in 2014 to 2015. I uh, worked in the uh, Dusseldorf of the Germany for the railway to push some of the business in Germany and other countries and uh, worked here for about two years. And when I back from Europe to China, and uh, we pushed another international um, uh, joint venture company uh, in China and uh, Singapore, and uh, we sit as a company of the YPL. So in the past five years, we worked with this company and also continue push the, the Yuxing Railway. So I will share about more about, about the railway and the nowadays not only like this, nowadays from the Chongqing area to the south, to the uh, west, to the north, it's by railway or maybe railway and the ocean. So this is a multimodal logistic, more about solution. Uh, the next part, I will share more about CCI uh, project results. The, this is uh, the, the, the blockchains from Chongqing to uh, Anshan with Qingzhou port. We call it a different name, but it's just like that. Like that. It's from Chongqing by railway connected to the ocean and the ocean to the uh, Singapore, to Malaysia, to Indonesia, to uh, uh, Vietnam, uh, to the, 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 the Thailand, uh, to the other countries, other ports, a lot of it. We can cover a lot. So just uh, this is a oh, moment. We will share more about that. So this is we call it. Maybe I have some the the name. Maybe later you can call it that. And also this is a part of the CSI project of YPL. YPL is the 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 Yuxing O Railway and the, the PIL logistic of Singapore, the joint venture, and the more focused on the container. Uh, FCL or maybe LCL uh, on the railway containers and also uh, cross border e commerce uh, the, the service, FBA multimodal transport, and also other service. So, this is uh, just like the service what we can do in the, in the maps. Uh -huh. This is the CCI about the CIL. Oh, I will share other product about this project. Maybe this is too short. Okay, hold on. I will share about the video about that. Uh -huh. Moment. Okay, I will share about it like that. This is a railway.
This is a, a railway uh, terminal of Chongqing. Some problem of the video. Okay. Just like that, I shared just now. This is Chongqing, and we sent the China Europe Railway Express just like that to the Europe, and about the Yangtze River, the the the, the budget on the Yangtze River. And also the new the international land sea trade corridor. This is a railway and ocean ship for the, the new logistic to the south. 
and uh, actually we have more blockchains from here to the uh, the Middle Asia, just like the the the, the, Kaza, the, the to the Kazakhstan to the uh, Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, or the Hazakistan, the Alamut and the Astana, uh, or Tuscan over here, and uh, we also have the the China Laos railway just like here, and the, the China Vietnam to the to the Haloi just like logistic, and also to the some the, the port of the Myanmar. Yes, this is uh, the 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 basic of the. The, the, the part uh, we do, we, what we did. Okay, so this is uh, just uh, I shared the, about the railway, the railway ocean ship, uh, multimodal logistic from the Chongqing to Qingzhou port and to other seaport of other countries. This is also the very important uh, project results of the CCI. As before, we didn't have that. Only have the uh, river, say, the, the the river, or just the, the the like that. But nowadays, more uh, balance solution to the company to the different companies. Ah, uh, this is uh, the second is also the our company. I will also share a video about the YPL. You can see, check that. Okay. I share about that. Moment. I will show about that. This one. This is it. Okay. This is a new video. Is the important trend in the development of the world economy. International trade and commercial development are inseparable from logistics and transportation. Policy encouragement and complete infrastructure have ushered in the dawn of the logistics industry. In 2013, Xi Jinping proposed a Belt and Road Initiative. Advocating countries along the route to share opportunities, new challenges, and achieve common development and prosperity. In 2015, the Chinese and Singapore Diamond signed an agreement to build the China Singapore Changing Administration Initiative on Strategic Activity. Focusing on financial services, aviation industry, transportation, and logistics, and to financial and communication technology. On February 26, 2017,
Yes, just now I directly take the pretension about this uh, company, the YPL, about what the YPL did and uh, what the service can provide. This is just like that. Uh, this is uh, the another, another service, is the truck. It's a block truck from the, the China to the Asian area from the, the Chongqing to the uh, every country by track to the just like a TER so this is just a transit by Mohan port or maybe Pinxiang port between the, or maybe Rainy port and the different around the border just like a, uh, between the Myanmar, the Laos, the Vietnam and also some of the Pakistan, also the Middle Asia, the different, but most and the 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 the, the, the Asian, um, is the the the, Asian, uh, the Southeast Asian. So nowadays, I can take this can the map. We can use the map. Continue to share it. Uh, just like this area, this area, area, just like that. Um, yes, the track from the, the, the inland of China to the laws, to the west, and to the, this area. And the, uh, the track can directly from the, the Laos, the Thailand, the Malaysia, and finally arrived in Singapore. Uh, actually, a lot of the uh, factory in China uh, some of the global factories, some of the ODE, uh, OEDM, uh, ODM factories uh, sent around the, uh, uh, the east area, just like the, near the Shanghai, the, the Nanjing, uh, Suzhou, just like there. And some of the, uh, in the Shenzhen, Fusan, Guangzhou, this area, and the more and uh, in last uh, in the past ten years, a lot of a lot of the, the factory uh, moved the factory inland of China, just in the middle area or west area, because there are uh, more uh, lower uh, hyper uh, costs and uh, a lot of the very uh, excellent of the tax uh, police. And uh, also some of the factory, for example, in the Guangdong province, some of the factory, especially some of the uh, uh, fabric uh, factory, some of the, the, the IT products uh, company, and some of the uh, small uh, machine uh, factory moved the factory directly to the loss of the Vietnam or some move it to Laos, to the area. So this is, uh, nowadays, some of the international cooperation for some products. So some of the parts from the inland factory of China, some parts for the other, other country by air or by ship, and uh, to uh, send all the, all the parts to the factory of the Haloi, and then how you send the, the cargo to the USA or Europe. Nowadays, some of the, some of the factory do, did it like that, uh, especially some of the uh, bicycles or maybe some of the uh, motorbike and the, also the fabric, the clothes, the shoes, a lot of that. Yes, so this is a new supply chain and a new uh, logistic to uh, cover it. So this is uh, the, the, the truck by the land transport. So you can say this, this is the truck, the Asian block trains, just like from the bonded warehouse. This is the bonded warehouse, bonded logistics center, and uh, send just like a cargo directly from the anywhere of China directly to any country of the Southeast area. Ah, this is uh, some of the transport lines. Uh, one is uh, from uh, Chongqing directly to the Pingxiang. Pingxiang is uh, uh, 
and a hair, Pingshan is a hair. This is uh, the, the Qingzhou port, just like they the said, the railway and the ocean ships, not only to Singapore, and, but also to some the, the port of the Indonesia, the ports of Malaysia, around this, the Haiphong, the Hutmin, uh, and also the, the, uh, the Bangkok, uh, Minchabang, Minchabang port of Thailand, and also some the, the, the ports of Malaysia to the ports around the here, here to the India, and also Pakistan around. So if they take the ocean ship, you can go anywhere just like that. Uh, this is uh, the this is our basic solution, and the second also the track totally track uh, block tracks from the, the, the inland of China and to uh, transport um, in Pingxiang port of the is a very big port city between China and the Vietnam and to the Hanoi. This is a lot of factory. Uh, uh, the, uh, send the new factory here, especially in the past three years, a lot of factory here, and also this is a railway, the China Laos railway, and the in future is will connect to the Thailand. Uh, this is a very fast. It the speed is about two hundred kilometers per hour for passengers. And one hundred and sixty percent kilometers per hour for cargo. So this in future will be really fast from the inland of to, to Vietnam. I think only only three or four days. This is very fast. Three or four days. Yes. Uh, as before, you only take track to here or maybe Mm, uh, by around the, the Yangtze River and by ocean ships to the port of Vietnam and then transport from the ports, maybe Haiphong ports or maybe other ports translated to the inland of the area. Nowadays, the railway linked. So the, the, the Laos also as before is the land block country, the land locked country. Nowadays is land linked country. So this is a very important for some inland country. And uh, this this railway from Chongqing Morhan Vientiane, this railway is uh, built uh, down uh, uh, in last years, I think in last uh, December and uh, about okay about nearly one year uh, it's uh, wrong very well, and uh, this part from the Vietnam and uh, the Vientiane to uh, uh, Linchabang, this railway is uh, building now, and uh, the second part is uh, from the Mekong River and, and next to the Langkai port, can link to the, the south of Thailand. So this is a very important railway connected to this this area in future. I think if you a lot of Chinese uh, tourists will take the train uh, directly to the this area to uh, for travel for business uh, for the, um, the the trade uh, for some the economic cooperation. And also some of the factory also take the railway to transport the cargo, the parts, the product in or out the market of China. You know, the, the China is a very big market in this area. This is the market of the, uh, of the, the uh, one, very big, right? And uh, this is also some of the Another branch railway to rainy port to the Ringo of the this part of Myanmar area, and, uh, and this is also uh, send the block, block of tracks. So this is a, this is a east east nine um, middle nine and the west nine 
from the, the Chongqing to the Pingxiang to this area, it's about 1,000 to 1,200 kilometers. And then here to, to, to Haloyi is only 200 kilometers. So we send the, the, block, the block track to, to the here, I think only maybe four to six days can directly arrive here. Maybe one working day transit in the Pingxiang port. And uh, mm, uh, this area, yes, Chongqing, Morhan, and to 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 Wentian, just like this, it's totally only uh, about the two thousand kilometers. Two thousand kilometers in China, if you take, if it will take a few times to transport times by high speed railway. So this is the this is the advantages of railway uh, by containers. Okay, this is uh, some of the service about the, this the block tracks. Uh, this is uh, uh, another project uh, of the multimodal logistic uh, center uh, in Chongqing. It's also a uh, 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 results, the Chinese company and the Singapore company, the VP uh, is uh, Vibrant Putin. Vibrant, Vibrant is a uh, very famous and uh, uh, very excellent logistic company in Singapore. And uh, uh, Vibrant also did uh, a lot of the warehousing and uh, other service, other other service in, in Singapore to do uh, warehousing, transporting, distribution, and also uh, have a lot of the warehouse in in Singapore and in Malaysia or uh, and Indonesia and uh, around the every country of the ASEAN, and also the uh, since our total venture the VP and the in Chongqing next to the port next the, the, the port just like this okay yeah 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 just like the, here this in the uh, uh, warehouse around the Goyuan port this is a Chongqing and this around the, the, the Yangtze River yes about to the to the airport to the airport Jambi airport is about 15 kilometers and uh, to the the bonded warehouse is about ten kilometers. To the, the, the downtown of Chongqing is about twenty two kilometers. So this is uh, the the choose uh, the area and uh, in future this uh, logistic part will do a lot of uh, the industry parts. So this is a uh, uh, this project this. Project is about the, the, the warehouse and the lower days. The warehouse is a steel building, and um, I think maybe maybe two thousand twenty three. The warehouse will be done, and uh, in future, maybe a lot of cargo will stored in the warehouse and distributed to anywhere, just like that. And uh, this is uh, some the introduce about this 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 project. The VP project is one of the focus project in Chongqing, and uh, we choose uh, the operation. You can say look to the heart of the Chongqing Yufu Industrial Park, just like this. This is a Yufu Park, Yufu Industrial Park in the in this district. And uh, around the, the highway, this highway, and the real late work, this is railway, and the uh, king ports, this is a port, not far, and the bonded warehouse, just like that. So it's uh, covered about all the, the resource, logistics resource, um, in uh, around uh, 15 kilometers. And uh, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, only 3.5 kilometers to the ports, and uh, just the I said uh, to the airport to the bonded warehouse. Yeah, this this part. Uh -huh. This is uh, the just the I said the the railway. We also call the is south bonded chan channel. Uh, yes, connected to Chongqing to the port to the anywhere other other part other country. This is a logistic. You can see here also nowadays from the Urmuc to Kass and to Yerkestan to Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, and also Africa, uh, Iran, and maybe Turkey in future, and to the um, uh, Middle East area, just like that. We have also the railway connected here. So this is a, 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 a logistic network. Ah, this is uh, why the real sea intermodal transport experience there are advantages. One part is more, and uh, the, the, the transport time is shorter than the river sea, just like that. Uh, it's only 15 days. Uh, and uh, this is the cost, is lower, too. and uh, the safety and the stable. And the easy color cast cast um, clearance, and uh, just like a powerful port authentication. So in future, this is uh, just like Yushin O railway, just like the new multimodal uh, transport like that, and uh, some of the truck block trucks uh, connect to other rail and. Uh, can do a lot of trade in the port. So this is very important. So maybe in future, Chongqing is not only a uh, very uh, big port inland of China, but also it's also the bonded, bonded just like that. Ah, this is a shared about the China uh, Laos uh, Railway. This is uh, some of the project in the CCI in the other countries. Actually, China and Singapore send the, 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 the project a lot only in China or in Singapore and also push the, the project in the third country, just uh, like in Laos. This is a project is um, the China Laos Railway. As before, I also visit uh, the, the 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 Laos government and push some of the international logistic park in Wenting. And we talked about uh, took the 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 transport uh, department of Laos government and push some of the cooperation uh, just like this i will share some of the the presentation about the project everyone you can you can get some of the information we did the international logistic in other country uh, how to do how to push how to uh, uh, do some of the project in the third country okay i will share about the pre the presentation about as we did before. Okay, a moment. I share another presentation. Haha, <laughs> this is another one. Ah, this is a, as before. As before, we we did the Chongqing. Uh, in now Ventian, the international railway, just like that, can say I will share about the developed and opportunities about the this one. We push it. Uh, this is a okay. This is some the about the our company, our the the, the, the shareholder, the, the Yuxin O, 
if the next time I will share about more about that, I will directly show you the Chinese, okay. That's right. Maybe can get some information. Uh, this is uh, as before in the 2017, the President Xi Jinping and also Corporation, the, 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 the chairman of the laws about the railway corporation, just like that from the from the, 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 the Chongqing and the uh, Kunmin and also to the Laos and this is uh, some of the logistic the terminal uh, oh no oh, oh. Oh, not like this hmm. Sorry, this is not like this, but uh, just I I just I shared that I I can't find the protection of the the Ventian logistic park. So I think in future this is a new logistic choose from China to the. Now to the Thailand, just like that, and uh, okay, this is another project. This is me, right? <laughs> okay, and this is uh, we we signed the MOU about the um, three country four parts of the in, uh, the international. Cooperation in Budapest. Uh, we uh, there are four countries. Uh, uh, one from uh, Singapore, one come from uh, Hungary, and uh, two companies uh, from China. And uh, we sign the MOU and uh, push the international uh, cooperation on the logistic. Uh, very interesting. And uh, I will share about this project because last year I uh, uh, stayed in Budapest uh, for six months to push this project. Uh, I will share more, but as before, we have a short break. Okay, 15 minutes later, we continue. Maybe I shared the the video. Alright.
Okay. Come on. Okay, everyone, let's back to the course and we continue about that. So, uh, just below, I shared the, 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 the video about the drill away from the CNN. But it's an old uh, video, it's about 2013, about 10 years before, at the start of the drill away. Uh, nowadays, the, 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 the China, Europe blockchain, every year, more than 10,000 blockchains, eastbound and westbound. And the next course, I will introduce more details and uh, service about the uh, China, Europe blockchain, and also the e-commerce, uh, cross-border e-commerce uh, logistic based on the railway. And uh, on this map, I shared some, uh, introduce about more about the transport and the logistic of CCI. Actually, CCI, uh, you can also, also can search the CCI on Google or maybe by doing the website. Not only the logistic, because uh, I'm a, a, a guy in logistic, international logistic. So I introduce more about the project of the of the log international logistic, the railway, the multimodal, the track, the river and the ocean ship, and the between the China and Singapore, and uh, also the uh, the uh, the third. Uh, country uh, in Laos and also in uh, Hungary, Budapest. Uh, last year, I also spent a lot of time to push this pro another project uh, in Budapest. So, uh, let's back to the project of CCI. So, this is a very important. Uh, the structure of the two countries to how to cooperation between different companies, different people from different countries. This is a G2G company, the G2G project. So that's why we have a strong support from the government. Actually, not only China, Singapore, the two countries have G2G company. We also have more uh, projects, for example, China and uh, Kazakhstan. 
I also visit Alamutu and Astala two times before. We signed a lot of cooperation and also sent the blockchain to Alamut uh, uh, from inland China to Alamut. Let's just like that. Or I, I look some maps, maybe share more easy understand it. We also have the blockchain sent to the, this area, the Kazakhstan, oh, I think here, the Kazakhstan and also the, the Kyrgyzstan, Kyr, uh, Kyrgyzstan, uh, uh, the, the city of the Tuscan and also the city of Alamut. And uh, we have some uh, increase very fast uh, trade uh, international trade between China company uh, with the local company in the Middle Asia, and uh, a lot of the, 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 the some the uh, the cargo from the Middle Asia we need to transport by railway. But but uh, uh, nowadays the problem is most the cargo from the especially some of the industry product uh, from China to other country. For example, if you are in Kazakhstan or maybe in, 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 in other country, maybe buy a lot of cargo uh, made in China and also maybe directly import from the China factory, China companies. So. This is uh, in the last, uh, in the past 40 years, uh, China uh, changed from uh, agriculture company, uh, agriculture country to an uh, industry country. And a lot of the factories, uh, uh, manufacturing, and uh, uh, produce a lot of a lot a lot of the cargo, different cargo. If you go to the supermarket, or maybe some local supermarket, or maybe um, you can check how many cans of the cargo made in China or maybe imported from China. But nowadays, more cargo not only made in China, maybe made in. Uh, Laos, maybe in Myanmar, maybe in uh, Vietnam, or maybe Thailand, uh, other countries. But if have the, the, the trade requirements and the, you can provide the international logistic to take the cargo or take the, the products from the local, local factory directly more fast, more and uh, stable and uh, low cost to anywhere of the the, 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 the the world. So that is why we uh, there are the railway linked to Chongqing and the Duisburg. Because about more than 10 years ago, uh, I, I think it's about 2009, uh, the, the Chongqing government uh, do a lot of work to uh, to talk with the HP, the laptop company, and also talk a lot of the ODM, con uh, ODM factory uh, with some the, the, in the Shenzhen, some in Taiwan, some in uh, Shanghai, and uh, do a lot of, um, uh, push the invest of the in the uh, in Chongqing. So that's why Chongqing have the shared about a foot percent of the uh, mechanic uh, uh, manufacturing uh, of the laptops every year. So if you have the trade retreat uh, requirements, you uh, uh, have the requirements of the international logistic to serve the uh, industry. Uh, in future, I think not only the inland of China. Uh, I think inland this land, this area, Europe and Asia, and uh, 
East Asia, uh, Southeast Asia, and the South Asia, Middle Asia, and also the West Asia, and also the Europe. This area have a more uh, tight trade and linked. This is why China uh, uh, provide the uh, initiative of the one road, uh, one bed. So maybe uh, more trade connected, more uh, supply chain cooperation. We can not only do the trade cooperation, uh, for example, buy our uh, finished cars, uh, the largest, the largest China, a lot of the uh, new energy cars, uh, just like a BYD, like a, like a Nishan, like uh, a lot of the new uh, 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 new uh, engineering uh, vehicles company to send the, the vehicles to the, all the world. And in the future, maybe in the local company, local some of the, you can provide some of the parts or maybe have some of the uh, uh, special lines, special um, uh, and uh, allow the license and also some of the new uh, market about that. You know the, 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 the traditional vehicles company just like uh, if you get some of the brand uh, vehicles in your mind, maybe some Germany cars, uh, Benz, uh, Volkswagen, the BMW and the, if you think some of them or some of the uh, vehicles from Japan, you can see uh, Toyota, Honda, Nissan, and maybe some of the vehicles from the, the, the South Korea, you can say the Kia, and the, the, the Honda, and a lot of, and also the, some of the other branded cars from the France, from Italy, from the United States, and maybe some of the local brand in your country. I'm not sure, maybe, uh, for example, Tata in, in India, and also some also very famous brand in, in, in your country, in your city. But if it, uh, the change some of the new uh, kind of the product, nowadays we, we have the, the, the fair, fair uh, cars, and the nowadays is a battery. A battery in your cars, you, you change it a lot. Nowadays in China, we are in China, and we open our our eyes to see everything changed very fast. And uh, you can see a lot of the industries in the, the branch factory and the branch company in anywhere, and the serve them very excellent, perfect product to the other world. As before, maybe the, the, the traditional finished vehicles, but nowadays maybe some the, the new kind of the cargo, new kind of the product, some of the equipment, some of the, just like the, the, the new engineering cars, just like a battery. And the, uh, you know, And uh, this is a new supply chain. So supply chain, uh, you can use more experience developed in China or also uh, in other developed country, uh, for example, in Singapore. And Singapore also have a really excellent industry experience uh, on the financing, on the logistic, on the uh, information technology, and uh, also we used the advantage and also push the product or some of the new product, new joint venture service and the new um, ways to the uh, big uh, market. So that's why in, last, in the past three years, uh, the coronavirus uh, 
make us cannot travel to other country easily and everyone stayed in home or stayed in company or stayed in a city we cannot fly to other country to talk the international cooperation and business and uh, I think also some of the uh, opportunities and the business in the local country in the local cities so you can think about how to link the new uh, the new service the new uh, international uh, opportunities cooperation between uh, some companies in china some companies in in other countries for example uh, in, in hungary uh, companies or hungary in kazakhstan or maybe companies in myanmar uh, as before, I, we also send the blockchains from China to Myanmar and then the, the railway to, to the border, uh, border the, the Moham. Uh, we send the blockchain to Moham port and then take the, the container by truck to, 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 to Myanmar. And in future, maybe more easy to do like that because the the trade between China or between your country and uh, more trade and you can link and you can find your the opportunities of your company or maybe your personally you can do something you can do some new 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 things and uh, actually in China <coughs> we also do a lot of the new kind of the logistic, new kind of the service. Nowadays, we, we in China, we, we didn't use uh, some of the new leaf style. We used WeChat more than uh, directly call phone. We used the, the, the Scott to pay money, pay pay for money, or maybe get, receive the money. We didn't nowadays. We we, we didn't use a crush. So this is a, a little a, a big change. And we also have some of the the e-commerce platform or apps on the, on my phone. And as before, uh, many years ago, we buy something, or maybe we want to use the e-commerce platform on a laptop or on a PC uh, we may be log in Amazon or maybe eBay or uh, some of the maybe Shopee maybe uh, but Shopee is a new one uh, as before we, we, we used some of the Alibaba as before but in the past 10 years this part e-commerce changed a lot and they will they grow up really, really fast and nowadays the, the second generation the second general we used the phone a lot of you can search in the apps and you can direct it to direct it to the uh, alibaba tomor uh, gd uh, also some of the maybe local uh, commer uh, e-commerce uh, uh, apps uh, in your country and uh, nowadays we some changed and also some of the video and uh, directly you can do some of the commerce uh, I don't know if you have some of the uh, use the TikTok is also a a Chinese company, the TikTok also have some of the 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 the, the, the treat on the uh, video. You can check the video and the snap, snap, snap. Okay, this product is very nice. You also can directly to get the orders and buy it. So this is more fast. This is a global. Then we. We don't care this cargo made in Chongqing or made in Beijing. Nowadays we just all give the orders and all of the people can get the service.
So this is why we also do a lot of on the uh, e-commerce. This is very important. But also, uh, on the other hand, maybe some of the in, in industry, in manufacturing, in agriculture, and also some of the uh, other uh, product or some of the manufacturing. Maybe you will very good or maybe know it very well in some area. Uh, for example, in the, some of the outer outer, outer uh, factory, yeah, maybe you have more resource and experience in the logistic company or maybe post. And you will think how to use the resource from the government, use the resource of the international platform, and also use the resource from the university. Uh, in China, every year, more than 3 million uh, uh, engineers uh, were granted from the, the different universities. But this, this data is, uh, I read the newspaper, and maybe more, because nowadays more and more uh, Chinese people, just like me, just like uh, a lot of young guys, will go to another companies in different country and also know each other very well. As before, China also, uh, most people in China cannot fly to other country, uh, a lot of reason, uh, some of them due to the money, due to the family, due to the some of the time. But nowadays, especially in the next 10 years, a lot of Chinese, a lot of the international global company, global, some people will travel to other country. Maybe, maybe three years ago, four years ago, I also visited the city of you in your country. Just like I have some the college games from the Singapore, from the Vietnam. I also have college games from the Hungary, and we also cooperation together uh, to the totally touches. So this is focused on the everyone focused on one sense to make it better and better. And then this. Uh, uh, also some for the trade, uh, maybe some for a very small business, but it's very interesting. And uh, you can get some of the uh, more information about um, some news from China, or some news from Europe, maybe news from the USA, or maybe you can get who can give the opportunities of business? That's why I. That's why we focus on the uh, the developing product. We can add our uh, support or our uh, effort about that. So that's why about ten years ago, no one. I think most of people. Um, don't believe the, the, the real way will uh, grow and develop to be so fast like that, like this. And uh, most people uh, doubt about the development of the one road, one bit. But uh, this is a, a, a totally uh, international cooperation linked to not only the uh, the, the treat, but also some of the new uh, opportunities. So if in future, I hope you and your friends and your family uh, take the chance to, uh, to visit China, visit Chongqing, and stay there one week or maybe uh, more uh, a long time in China to 
to to to know about a、uh, lot of what happened in China.、Uh, our city developed very very fast in the past twenty years. Chongqing is from a small city developed like that. Nowadays it's very big. It's very modern. You can see very beautiful of the city, and in future. More and more cities of China also developed like that. You know that in the in in China, there are about uh, uh, more than uh, more than one hundred cities. Uh, each uh, the population more than one million. So every every city developed. Some is together, and not only EU and this one, but together and some around in Shanghai, some cities around in、uh, Hong Kong, Shenzhen, and Guangzhou, some uh, cities uh, around the Peking and Tianjin, and in the west,、uh, a lot of cities around Chongqing and Chengdu. This is the area developed together.、Um, So that's why very strong and the e-commerce about developed a lot only the logistic, but also the finance, but also the 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 other industry.、Uh, in China, a lot of very interesting about that. I will if if you want to know more about. You also can have some friends in China, or some、uh, teachers in our university, and、uh, you can get more information.、Uh, some some maybe give you some the nice idea, and then some new opportunities, or maybe new ideas about how to how to run your company or how to. Help you to do it better in your company, or maybe get some of the new uh, uh, work, uh, some job information from some like global companies. Then nowadays we,、uh, as before, I visit、uh, Ventian and、I、talk with、uh, some guys in in the. A、railway department of Laos.、Uh, as before,、uh, Laos only has a very very short railway in Laos,、um, and this is only one.、Uh, this is only one terminal, rail terminal to link the railway in Thailand, and we we give some the. Presentation and show what happened in China about the railway, also the transport, the high speed, high speed、uh, trains. The, most people are surprised, and、uh, they can't believe it. It very came true、uh, in Laos train. This is about three years ago. And、uh, they don't know the railway will just like that totally,、uh, totally model high speed and more safe and very nice railway、uh, will、uh, locked in Laos. So about three years ago, or as before, before the、uh, last December. Only four kilometers railway in Laos to run. So operation operates of the the terminal and only four kilometers railway. But after the December of last year, the Laos has the longest high speed railway in the Asian. So it's it's developed to jump to a, a next stage, 
not not one or uh, one uh, four kilometers, forty kilometers, four hundred kilometers, four thousand kilometers. The speed will not not like forty kilo meters per hour and eight kilometers per hour directly from the zero and to the new stage directly to the maybe only 10 kilometers per hour directly to 200 kilometers per hour this is a changed the totally so this we can use the, the new technology the new transported uh, solution the new uh, uh, service and the new ideas to cooperation so that's why changed a lot but in future this is a big invest of the railway and uh, not only for business but only for the level of the local people to 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 work and to live in the modern society and uh, more easy to get the cargo get the information get the new friendship between different country and also changed the local city change the your country to our new developed models so a lot of for political just for logistic just for the trade just for the 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 the, the, the low more uh, so in future i think a lot of the business opportunities to to cooperation and uh, we can use this new platform the new communicate apps the new um, ideas to get the news get the uh, discuss like this um, as before we also discuss some the people in europe we discuss in germany in france also talk a, a lot of the cooperation in guys of Poland and uh, Hungary and also uh, some of the guys in UK but you know we not only to learn how to do it many years ago in Europe but we want to use this experience to our work to our company and how to cooperation now and the future this is very important we learning a lot of the history you know china is a country with more than five thousand years of history but this is only history we knew we get the experience we get the ideas from the history and connect the technology and the opportunity of the international cooperation we push some new ideas this is very, very huge but for us for one company for one pe for one person or for one team we just get how what we can get uh, what we will do in future in this structure so this is why in the project of CCI, we used the support from the China government and the C and the Singapore government. Actually, not only the two governments from the country, but we can get the support from the government and get more uh, some uh, more resource in different country we also uh, thinking uh, um, further not only for three or five or ten years now we want to do something for future just like this railway as before actually 
10 years ago, the railway is built down, is built well. But no one organization organized the blockchain from China to Europe or maybe Europe to China. That's why it's only the railway and the different the ones. You know, in the Middle Asia, the ones is the uh, 1,052. Uh, 1,520 uh, millimeter uh, meters is the length of the wagon. But in China and Europe, it's different. It's only 1,040, 1,450. So the, the difference, the wagon, the width different. So we have, uh, we have to just like the video transit transit in the border from the container from the China train the train from China to the train of Kazakhstan so this is a different platform and arrived in the border of the Europe Union and the Bell Russia will also take the container from the Brest to Malashevich Poland. So this is the different rules, different railway, different kind of the of, uh, wrong rules. So this is why I want to share to everyone, not only focus the work you are doing, but also you can, you can look for far, around and thinking something in future this is this is just a share And uh, I also shared some of the new, uh, new about that. Maybe some of the, okay. this is a new. This is uh, some of the, the largest and uh, China push the new railway um, in the countries in, uh, next to China. This is uh, to the China linked to the Middle Asia, the uh, Kyrgyzstan and the Uzbekistan. This is a cars, uh, the, the, the bonded of the, 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 the China and the Kyrgyzstan. This is Yerkestan. Yerkestan to the Tuscany. So this is a new uh, railway, maybe start to build uh, next year in 2023. In future, this is a will link to Tuscany and maybe distribution to the Middle Asia and to Iran and also to the be uh, to the uh, Middle Asia. So this is in future. I think also this part also some of the business opportunities. For example, this one here. If you are in uh, Middle Asia, you maybe a lot of the warehouse, a lot of the track, a lot of the bonded service. And that some of the factory or some of the trade company to link, use this straight away to do some business. And uh, for example, the, 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 the China, uh, Europe blockchain as before, only one port, the, the, the bonded port of the 
Alasanko of the Xinjiang province. But in next day, uh, soon, the Kazakhstan government sent the, uh, some the tree, the, the bonded tree, the park in Tangani and uh, uh, Horgos. So nowadays it's developed very, very fast about the uh, cross border trade. Some of them are e commerce trade, sometimes it's uh, uh, the traditional trade, just like some meat, some the, the, the fabric, some the, the, the normal cargo in supermarket. And some some people, some young people also invest the the the, the, the trade between China and Kazakhstan. It's very really busy now. It's like a new new like a new city uh, between on the border. Uh, this is opportunities. So I think also this railway uh, started to build. Uh, in, uh, in uh, 2023 and uh, also around the railway I think some some new choice and maybe more Chinese logistic company will look for some uh, local partner uh, in Kyrgyzstan or maybe Uzbekistan or maybe in the Middle Asia uh, other countries in the Middle Asia uh, a lot of uh, country named Stan, yeah. And uh, this one is the China-Pakistan railway. But nowadays only uh, the, the road, the highway, the road. Uh, in China, the Kazakhstan, the Pakistan railway, and also to Guadal Guadal ports. This is the plan uh, of the, of the, in future, if not, we may more easy to from the, from the middle 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 east. This area can more easy to link of the inland of China. And this is, is I think soon. I think maybe maybe. Several years later, this will will come true. This is a lot far from here to there. I think only if we will start to build the railway, I think only three or four years we will build it finished very, very fast. And also, this is another, but I don't know. This maybe also have some the in uh, international cooperation. Maybe nowadays only gas, gas or maybe turtle from from the port of Myanmar and to the Yunnan. But in future, actually more easy to cooperation and the more uh, nowadays you can say Kunming uh, have the railway directed to Vientiane of Laos, and in future I think more. Have some of the business, some of the international business to direct me to with China, or maybe some of the fact, some of the product made in Myanmar, and will send by the truck or maybe by railway directly to the huge market of China. The actually the population of China is one point four. This is a very, very, very huge market. Everyone will shopping, everyone will eating, everyone will, will buy clothes, buy shoes, and buy some of the hand used. And, uh, and the more and more people uh, get richer, so uh, the will more. Uh, requirements of the cargo different from different country, different area. Or maybe some the the, 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 the food or maybe uh, some local culture cargo 
yeah, I can't go. just like a fruit, just like the, some of the southeast fruit, uh, like a dura, just like that, can direct me by air, directly sent from your local city to, to the market of China. Maybe south of China, maybe north. China is very, very huge. So you can focus the, on some the small parts of the market. If the product sell very well, you can send a, a international trade company or maybe in future use this logistic solution, logistic in the real way, you can get some idea of the of the new uh, business. So this is, a, I want to show the three maps to everyone about the, the, the opportunities of business and the uh, logistics, uh, the, the, the relationship of that. Uh, it always is seen in in Chinese ways, uh, if you want to, if you want to get richer, you must build the road first. If you want to build the first, you build the the road first. You want to think in it first. So this is very important. If you get the international course this time and uh, get a lot of the information from me, from other teachers from our university, you will get some new ideas and one or two ideas will help you to do your business better and better or maybe get some of the new uh, international uh, requirements or maybe maybe some of the, the big hair the big developed of the uh, business it's very very helpful this is uh, the I think this is the key point if you are working in some company or some of the departments in logistic transport or maybe post most of them, you can think about it. It's a very, very true. This is uh, some words from my heart. Then this is uh, in future. I think China will use this like this. The different inland transport ways will link the the neighbors countries just like hey, together. Uh, push it together with your labor, uh, your friends. So that's why we help some company or some country to build some the new bridges, to build some new highways. We build some the uh, airports or maybe railway uh, from the some project of the. Chinese government, we we don't don't just uh, to provide some the the the, the what is we help more friends to how to use it. We use it to do some business together and use the different advantage resource maybe some the resource in your city or maybe some resource in your com company or maybe in some special resource of your country we can do it together some is for government some is for business but business is easy because business is business we don't care about the political, so we don't care about the military, we don't focus on other things. We just to you and your partner to do it together. So this in future you can see 
uh, also search the railway channel to Laos like here this is railway uh, built up last year and this is this year will one year you can get a lot of news about it and I think you will get more and more surprise news of the new railway from China to Laos or maybe China to Thailand in future. This is basically on the railway, basically on the logistic, you will get more business and ideas. This is we what we can get the different friends from the other country, other uh, cities. So this is open. This that's why we we call us China, Chongqing and China. We are open up. We are open our uh, mind and eyes to to push the the business in future. Not, not only future and the lower days. Lower days we also and uh, we also do some the moment I close my window. <laughs> back yeah and uh, uh, the last 50 minutes of the this course I hope if you have some question if you some the question want to ask me please input and let me know and uh, I will answered directly you can send your uh, your question in words like here and i will read and uh, answer and try my best to answer your question uh, so this is the r uh, r and the cool time
And in the, the last 10 minutes of this course, I will uh, list some of the topics to thinking or maybe discuss. Because uh, as before, I, uh, I take the, the, the course like that, I will ask some of the, ask the to interview uh, each other where are you from and uh, how do you know Chongqing and about uh, know anything of Chongqing? Do you know the Chongqing, the city? Yeah, the, someone the first the know the city in first time. And uh, uh, the second, how about the partnership uh, with China in one row one bit uh, initiative or CCI now? Um, you maybe maybe your country uh, in Asia or maybe in Africa or in other uh, anywhere, maybe I think have some the, uh, economic uh, partnership with China. And also maybe some of you, you have some of the Chinese friends and uh, okay, let's see. And uh, you can ask or maybe you can know some of the some of the uh, news about that, or maybe, oh, this is the first time to know the CSI project, or maybe the one row one bit, the uh, initiative, okay, you, you know it's the first time. Maybe you are students in university or some schools, you are thinking what you will do in future, and maybe look for some of the new jobs which area or some the, which one is, is your uh, uh, interested in. And uh, what's the best and the most attractive in China in your opinion? Maybe you have visited China before or maybe you still uh, didn't uh, visit to some of the, in the international travel, especially in the last three years, you can think how to know each other. This is also for us like that. We, it's for us, it's more easy if you have some of the contract with, with some of the foreigners, some of which had some of the, uh, the other, other, other uh, communicate apps. It's more easy nowadays by, by some of the, the communicate apps. And in future, what do you want to do in China or in your city? This will be very important. I think you get you after uh, um, finish the course about two hours and uh, listen to my sharing about that. Uh, for me, I'm uh, one of the international businessmen, and uh, I would all, I perf uh, prefer to share my experience and my ideas to my friends, and also to to you. And uh, what do you think? And what do you want from Chongqing, from China, from? some international business, international cooperation in future. If you learn the course, not only my course, not uh, from a course, uh, all the course uh, from our university, you, what you get, the experience, the sharing, and also some new ideas you get, or maybe some new apps, some of the new uh, models 
you want to copy in your city. Just as before, I shared the e-commerce. Some of the, some students want to do the e-commerce soon, and also some of the logistic. If you are some the real way, some some the warehouse in your company in your、uh, city, maybe some corporations. This is,、uh, for example, some of the I know some students from the Africa. I know a lot of the Chinese government.、Uh, Uh, Chinese company do a lot of international business in Africa. This is a this is a new market,、uh, and also、uh, also some the factory or some the local uh, uh, manufacturing directly to copy the the the, the about twenty or thirty years ago. Uh, the Chinese people did it the same, and the Lardes copied and or maybe learning how to run the factory, how to make, how to do the the the, the international business, some trade. So,、uh, okay, you can buy a lot a lot of people, a lot of the、uh, people from Africa also lived in China. And、uh, do some the fabric、uh, trade, or maybe some the、uh, also some the device trade directly、uh, buy in China and and also send by containers to 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 Africa, and also a lot of the cargo in your city in your country, and、uh, how to make the advertisement, how to do the marketing. And how to do the sales in the in the market, and look for the partners and push the business in different country, and this is very important. Maybe as before, I also some friends. I have a lot of friends in Europe, and also some friends have business in Africa, and they also the first thing is I sell the cargo to the. To the London and to the Brussels or maybe Hamburg, but if you want to balance the risk and the, the different area, you, I think it's a suggestion. It's a suggestion. You can take some attention to the East Asia, East Asia, not only China, China, Japan, South Korea. And、uh, Singapore and uh, uh, a lot of the country of the East Asia. Some nowadays you can see which company, which country、um, have more engineering energy to develop the industry and the more demands of the import and output and export of the cargo. The parts, the something. So this is, I think, you. I hope you can think about it. Okay. I want. I check. Any question? Okay, come on, come on, guys. <laughs> <coughs> I saw some of the some students,、uh, officer, yeah. Ah, Sui, 
three girl uh, students from Myanmar are uh, uh, officer of the the, the trade department, the transport and the communication department, and some are from the the post department of the government. So I and and also some of the students uh, from the from the commerce and the industry, uh, the, some are from, yeah, different. Some the, some students are, are GM, yeah, the GM of the, some trade company, and some are sales manager, engineering, and uh, okay. Okay, some are senior manager. Some some uh, some students are teachers. Mm -hmm. So, okay, let's down uh, this uh, course, uh, and the next day time, uh, th uh, this Thursday. We will continue to the another uh, another part of our course, and I also will share about the more details about the e-commerce. Okay, thank you, thank you very much, thank you everybody. Goodbye. Thank you. Bye bye.